540 now. We've got continuing coverage of DMV downfalls. Good morning and happy Thursday. Now we've been covering possible changes to how the DMV operates for months and today there's another idea that's on the table. Some North Carolina lawmakers are considering privatizing some of the DMV's functions. Now that just means to have a private business handle certain operations rather than the government. As for which responsibilities could be handed over, it could be things like software upgrades, maybe some other roles, but privatiz privatization would be complicated. So a study has taken place right now to see if it's even feasible to contract out some or even all of the DMV's current functions, at least in North Carolina. That study is conducted by legislative staff and it's set to wrap up by May. Now here's the hang up though. The DMV manages obviously a lot of sensitive data and that federal government requires it to be kept confidential. Now, more important to note here, the agency also interfaces with that voter registration information and criminal records. Meanwhile, the North Carolina DMV is planning a pilot program for self-service kiosks. Now, we told you here on WCNC Charlotte some months ago, they'd be placed at some of our grocery stores. The program was initially set to launch last fall, but lawmakers say it should roll out in the coming weeks. Hopefully those kiosk locations will allow folks to take care of DMV services outside of those normal office hours.